One of the mistakes most of the test takers make is giving so much importance to the language that they use to transform the case note on their OET writing test. They are thinking language is the most important criterion in OET to crack band B or higher. Surprisingly, it is not. As we all understand, OET is a language proficiency test just like any exam, IELTS, TOEFL, PTE, where your language is assessed. And OET is not different too. Yes, it's also a language proficiency test where your language is assessed. Okay, so we all think that in OET writing, language is the most important aspect. But as I said, it is not. If we go to the OET writing evaluation criteria, we can see that we have six criteria, namely purpose, content, conciseness and clarity, genre and style, organization and layout, and language. Language is the sixth criterion in OET writing, and this criterion carries only seven marks, maximum of seven marks, out of 38 and in this language criterion the sixth criterion in OET writing they have included all the parameters that are required to evaluate a test takers language proficiency such as grammar vocabulary punctuation spelling mistakes everything if we have all these parameters that is more than enough to evaluate a test takers language proficiency but in OET you have five other parameters that don't talk about language at all, that don't talk about vocabulary, that don't talk about punctuation, that don't talk about the spelling mistakes that you make, then what it talks about? It talks about case note and licensing. Let me make it very clear. You go to OET writing evaluation criteria. The first criterion is purpose, okay? And the maximum mark is three. So if I want to crack three out of three for purpose, I just need to make my purpose of the letter immediately apparent. Then I have to expand it sufficiently in later paragraphs. That's it. I will be getting three out of three for purpose. Then let's talk about the second criterion content. There you have to include all the relevant information. That's it. Then consider the third criterion conciseness and clarity. For conciseness, you have to remove all the irrelevant information. Similarly, we have genre and style. This is the fourth criterion and this criterion tells us that our writing should be factual and professional. That's it. We don't uh, need to write the, you know, highly grammatical structures, higher vocabulary, nothing. So we spoke about four criteria among the total six of OET writing evaluation. None of these criteria talk about the language that they use in OET writing. The total marks for OET writing as per evaluation criteria is 38 and language the criterion, six criterion that carries only seven marks out of 38. That means 31 marks out of this 38 go for case note analyzing. We discussed about the criterion content, purpose, conciseness and clarity that don't talks about language at all, that talks about relevant points, that talks about excluding irrelevant points, that talk about whether you are presenting your key information, whether you are highlighting it, that's it. So if you want to crack maximum marks for these criteria, you just need to improve your case note analyzing. And how you can improve your case note analyzing? You need to develop good reading skill. You need to analyze it correctly. You need to read it thoroughly, carefully. Then you can crack the maximum marks for OET writing. So we have to understand it is our case note analyzing skill rather than the language which has got so much importance in OET writing since 31 marks out of 38 goes for case note analyzing how well you are reading the case note, how well you are segregating the key information and all. It doesn't talk about the language. But yes, language is important too. You have to use the correct grammatical structures. You have to use the right vocabulary, but you don't need to think too much about it. 
okay so give importance to case note analyzing over the language that you use you have to use the correct language you should not use grammatically incorrect structures you should not use wrong vocabulary this should be appropriate but give importance to case note analyzing because as i said this carry maximum marks for your oet writing i hope that is useful thank you